Hi everyone, this is Paul Window. Welcome to the next phase of your challenge where we are going to learn how we can retarget those people who already know you. The people who already come on your website, the people who already come on your Facebook page, they already like, comment, share, or they visited on your page. Everywhere, they, anywhere you, they knows you. We can target those people with the all ad strategy that what we will be learning in this phase. This phase is totally dedicated how you can turn your visitor into your happy customer. That what is all about. Now, before starting guys, uh, you need to be understand that part guys. Um, for retarget those people, we need to capture their attentions. We need to capture them. And Facebook allow us with their tools with their functionality that we can capture those people who come on our website right even facebook allow us in the later on facebook allow us to use that part to retarget those people who already come on your website now for retarget the people you need to be install a facebook pixel code that analytic code that will be provided by the Facebook and we can install we need to be installed that code into our website right it's very easy in the next video I will be show you how you can do that one how you can install that code uh, into your website but before that you need to be understand that part is a Facebook pixel code is just an uh, analytic code where a piece of code that code you need to be installed into your website once you install it then facebook will start to capturing the data from your website whoever come on your page whoever come on your website what kind of action they are taking facebook will capture their data through that analytic code right in the next video i will be show you how you can install that code so that is basically what the Facebook pixel code is, right? Now, before installation of the pixel code, you need to be know that what kind of CMS you are using to uh, for your website. What the CMS is, guys? Content management system. For example, WordPress. The websites created onto the WordPress. The website created through the Shopify, Wix, uh, WooCommerce. What sort of CMS your website? is created with do not worry about i will be giving you a tool where you can easily uh, check it out what sort of cms you are going to use it if you're on the screen guys go to the google just search on cms detector you will be get that link here um what cms dot organization right oh you will become it here enter your website where you want to install that pixel code just click on detect Within a second, they will be show you what sort of CMS you are going to use for your website. Here you will be see it here. It's in WordPress. So guys, 90 to 95% businesses, websites are made with the WordPress. They're using the WordPress CMS. So I highly recommend if you are using a WordPress, um, I will be show you how you can do that. Otherwise, there are lots of ways you can install into the another CMS. If you are using, you can use an easily that pixel code. So that's the pixel code is guys. This the pixel code is then just analytic tools that allows you to measure the effectiveness of your advertising by understanding the customer action people take on your website so that we can easily target a specific people the people who already come on your website which page you are going they are coming on right so you need to be know about the cms this is the important thing now another thing you need to be know before installing the page pixels code onto your website guys you need to be download a one extension I will be show you that extension name is Facebook pixel helper that will help us that will help you to understand whether your pixel core is working or not that is a free extension by Facebook that's a Google Chrome extension for that what you need to do is you need to be go to the Google and just search for it Facebook pixel helper 
extension right so once you click on it here they will be give you this link facebook pixels helper click on it and they will be allow you to download this extension onto your google chrome once you download it guys i already downloaded it that's why they will be saving to remove from chrome once you download you will be able to see this box here facebook pixel helper if you are unable to do it you will be see this extension click on it you will be able to see it somewhere here and you can click on this pin that will become here right you need to be do this thing before start installation of facebook pixel code onto your website i'm right first the understand about the facebook pixels is that's just an analytic tool an analytic code that you need to be installing into your website i will be show you in the next lesson how you can do that once you install it facebook will communicate with your website and they will be capturing the old data from your website right all the people who come on your website the facebook will have that data they will start it and the second thing you need to be know what kind of cms you use for your website i mentioned you how you can do that and the third thing download the chrome extension facebook pixel helpers so that you will be know that after the installation of pixel whether it's working or not isn't it awesome guys it's fun right so in the next video i will be show you how you can install it that will be really helpful for you and see you in the next video i hope that will be help you out and do the work if you do if you will not do that you will not go further to do all the tasks thank you so much guys see you in the next video